What did you learn from last year? You got you got to win in, and then you got to play two games. Does that help a little bit going in with the mindset about the intensity and all that stuff? I don't know. Uh, last year is a completely different team than this year. Uh -huh. But uh, I mean, our team we're, we're looking at uh, winning some games. There's no doubt about it. And uh, we're excited about the challenge. You've had such a great run here the last two or three months for rebounding stuff, and you've just been focused on that and, and hard working and get down there in the blue collar and all that stuff? Yeah, it's all about toughness and wanting more rebounding wise. Uh, there's obviously some skill that goes involved, it's all about wanting more and uh, try to help our team win whatever way I can. When you see Peter get in a zone like that, are you just trying to get him the ball, send him his screens? Because you know if he's going to get open, he's going to hit it. Yeah, yeah, I try to get him open as much as possible. we got we got a great relationship together, and uh, he finds me when I'm open, and I try to get him open as much as possible. Thanks, man. Yep. Adam, you guys are going to the NCAA tournament for a third year in a row for the first time, I think, since 91, 92 here. So that's a long time. <laughs> I didn't I mean, know that, yeah. yeah what, I mean, what's that mean, kind of? I know you came here wanting to establish, reestablish Iowa basketball. Yeah, it's disappointing because I think we should have won our, my freshman year. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, uh, being able to go four years would have been cool, but three years, I'll take it. Uh, it's a special honor. Uh, this is a great program we got here. And I just wanted to be a part of something special, and uh, I think I've done it, And uh, but my time's not up yet, so we've got some more special things we can do, and uh, so we can go out there in the tournament. What's it going to take to make a dent in the tournament this year? Uh, just focus and poise. Uh, I think every team would say that. Uh, limit turnovers, try to get a good shot every time, and play as good defense as you can. So it's a culmination of things. you got to get lucky, there's no doubt about it. But uh, you just got to try to go play your best basketball now. What's been the talk in the locker room? I know Pete said you guys didn't practice till today, but in talking to the guys following that loss, what is the mindset heading into this new tournament? Yeah, we're excited. Everybody's 0-0 zero, zero going into this. I mean, no matter what you did in the uh, regular season, it doesn't matter. There's upsets every, every game or every uh, bracket. So. We're excited about where we are and uh, just getting a chance to go out and compete against some of the best teams in the country. Who was most excited when Brooklyn popped up on the score? I think OK, because he's uh, originally from, he actually lived out in New York. So, And then I didn't see Coach Francis. He's uh, He coached at Villanova, and he's out from the uh, from the Queens, I think, area. So he's probably excited to go back home, too. So those guys are definitely probably excited to see some family they probably haven't seen in a while. You've played in New York before, but I've never Brooklyn. What are your expectations heading into the Barclays Center? Uh, just another arena, honestly. Uh, they're going to be the same dimensions we play here, same size hoop, same size basketball. So we're ready to go go play wherever they want us to. But it's not the same.